Hey there guys, what's going on? In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to add supports in Bamboo Studios. I repeat, I'm gonna show you how to add supports to your 3D prints. All right, so first get into Bamboo Studio, right? And make sure you have the right printer selected. There's probably only one choice, the printer you have if your printer is connected appropriately, right? And if you go down here a little bit, uh, there's five tabs, right? We have quality, strength, speed, support, and others. We need to click on the support tabs. What we need to do here is click on enable support. We need to check this box. And there's two different types of support for the most part, right? There is the normal support. So if we click on this and we click on the preview tab and this starts to preview for us, this is gonna generate our supports and it's gonna show us what it looks like with the supports. And this is the general type of supports, right? And it, uh, over here, it's gonna tell us how long the print takes, uh, the bridging, all kinds of crazy stuff, right? So this is what the normal support looks like. And you're gonna have to mess around and kind of learn how this, like how normal supports works with prints versus the other type of support, which is known as tree support. So if we, cl if we click back to prepare over here on the left hand tab, that's where you have to click to kind of like edit your prints, right? The preview tab is kind of moving forth into the next stage towards printing. So let's go on over here when we're in the prepare tab and click on tree supports. And I'm gonna click on preview, right? This creates it all, and it's gonna give us an idea of what this is going to look like with this different style of supports. And as you can see here on the right hand side here in the corner, it's generating the, the layers, the G codes, all that stuff. This is what the print looks like with tree support. I personally have better luck with using the tree support, uh, printing stuff like these Pokemons, but it really kind of depends. Sometimes if I'm doing small prints, I'll literally just do two I'll print it in both supports and because you don't really know until you print it. It's a long story. But guys, hopefully this helped you figure out how to add supports in Bamboo Studio and add supports to your prints. So good luck to your printing. Please subscribe. Hit me up in the comments. I will see you in the next one. Peace.